chairs remain standing. The defendant remains standing. Everyone else can be seated. Let me inquire. Thank you, Your Honor. Uh, Madam Foreperson, has the jury agreed upon its verdict? Yes, we have. Would you hand the verdict slips to the court officer, please? the verdicts. All right, Madam Foreperson, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, hearken to your verdict as the court will record it. On indictment 19, CR 168, count one charging murder, you upon your oath say the defendant is guilty of murder in the first degree by reason of extreme atrocity and cruelty. So say you, Madam Foreperson. So say you, ladies and gentlemen of the jury. Yes. Has this verdict been unanimous? Count two, charging assault and battery by means of a dangerous weapon. You, upon your oath, say that the defendant is guilty. So say you, Madam Foreperson. Yes. So say you, ladies and gentlemen of the jury. Yes. Has this verdict been unanimous? Yes. Thank you. You may be seated. <laughs> Sir, you may be seated. All right. Members of the jury, I want to take this one final moment publicly to thank you for your service in this case. Thank you for the careful attention you gave me, the lawyers, and the parties in this case, and for your work to deliver a verdict. Uh, I told you during the course of the trial that when the trial was over, you were free to speak to anybody you'd like about this particular case. Uh, but I want to let you know that the opposite of that is also true. You are perfectly free not to speak to anybody about this case ever again. I suggest to you, given the privacy of your jury deliberations, that you consider that when you're discuss if you choose to discuss the case uh, with anybody outside this courtroom, that you uh, keep in mind the sanctity and privacy of the jury deliberations and, and, uh, and uh, provide that to one another to keep, to keep that private. But again, your discharge as jurors, that's entirely up to you now. You're under no sanction or order of the court. So thank you very much. I will um, come back to talk to you and thank you privately in just a few moments. Thank you all for your service. Sure, thank you. All right. Mr. Green. Thank you, Your Honor. The Commonwealth would move for sentencing, but we would ask the court uh, for some time for the family to hear impact statements and collect themselves. I know that you're not available on Friday. Um, Monday is the day after a holiday. The family has asked me if we could schedule sentencing on Tuesday. Do you have any um, issue with Tuesday, counsel? Yeah, just one moment. Sure. Tuesday at 10 o'clock then, okay? Thank you. Tuesday morning at 10. Thank you. Stepping off. All right. Thank you.